Okay, how to run WordPress your local machines? We the first we go to WinEngine.com. Here on WordPress org. Let's go. The first we download WinEngine. So we could download now and hit OK. Go. Click select English language, click next, continue, accept agreement, next, and the following folder, engines, which is all, next, uh, for a shortcut, adminer, install. Okay, we just on the second time. And okay, and finish. Now it's running. Oh. Win, win engines. Okay, as you can see, we have the tray and just start all. Okay, workbench, my project, create project, empty. Um, Okay. Okay, uh, so uh, we have installed the Win Engine. As you can see, Engine is not starting, it's not running. So we stopping here and we go to the config sites here and we choose uh, not here uh, let me check uh, yes maybe here. oh yes in engine logs and error logs so as you can see we have uh, some issues program like this um You can, as you can see, uh, the running local address IP is failed for port 443. So let me check. Uh, uh, we go to the uh, Win Engine and conf and edit this file. So we go some here. Uh, let me check. As you can see, we have. Uh, some thing like this server listen study. so we change the port number for eight and save it and go back to the win and win board local server manager and start as you can see we start all for now and go back here and choose the local open websites and it works okay so if we go here wordpress and open websites you create new website with engines so now we choose the uh, as you can see we have uh, the server config so now we go to the WordPress. So we in here maybe English WordPress and download progress. Ready started. Download and let go. Uh, 
as you can see, we have home root from how to progress public. So browser websites folder, click here. Okay, and open it the how to progress. So when the folder down, uh, we open it. Mm. Okay, so which is a public copy, copy, and how this work here. So and extra file here. Mm. Mm, maybe here okay so uh, public so we copy all cut and paste here and oh, okay and now we mm, okay. So now we open it, the sites, continue. And uh, so uh, now we must create a name, username, password for us. Let's go. Okay, choose the username, WordPress. Uh, if we try to use WordPress database, so database manager. And we put here root and go. No password, safe. So we must uh, choose user and end user. Uh, maybe edit privileges. Okay. And change the password. Uh, Maybe choose admin, admin, and go. It's the same here. Mm -hmm. So we create database. Uh, maybe here. WordPress, so we choose here WordPress and choose the coding and create. So now we go back here WordPress user root password admin and submit. Server local authority to lose that. Try again. Okay. Okay, user. And we also change information here. And go. And log out for now. As you can see, don't correct password. And now go back here, try again. So WordPress admin. And now we run the install. 
Okay, title to WordPress username maybe admin admin so confirmations with password your email I don't know admin maybe WordPress TLD and install ah okay my mistake and I think it's confirmation and install. Okay, so login admin admin and now visit the sites and voila hit a word and recognize it it's 